Hey everyone, today we are diving into UEFN's new in-island transaction feature, a way for you to create your own in-game economy by offering items to players in exchange for V-Bucks. In order to publish your project using in-island transactions, you'll need to review and agree to the updated Fortnite developer terms in the creator portal. Now let's take a look at how this feature works in-game in a small demo we put together using content from the in-island transactions feature example. As a part of this feature, we've added two new types of items for your islands to leverage, durable items and consumable items. Take this shovel for example. In our demo, players use the shovel to dig up plots of land. Players only need one shovel, so using Verse, we've set this up to be a durable item with a maximum value of one. After digging up this plot, we can now plant a corn seed. Because corn seeds should be consumed after each use, we set this up to be a consumable item. You'll notice that this time, unlike the shovel, when we plant the corn seed, it disappears out of our inventory. Using the new in-island transaction system, we'll offer players a quicker way to collect corn seeds by selling packs that offer 10 seeds each. The corn seed pack is also set up as a consumable item, as it's consumed to grant 10 corn seeds. The difference is, We've added code to classify the item as an offer, meaning players will purchase it in-game for a set V-Buck price. Please note that the purchase flow for all in-game transactions will use the same trusted checkout screens that can't be modified by developers. Testing will not deduct V-Bucks from your account. You can find information about how to test in-game transactions in the documentation. Now, to help players stock up even quicker, we can pair multiple items together to create a bundle. Here we have the seed pack bundle. The seed pack bundle comes with two corn seed packs as determined by our verse code. We also have the starter bundle, which includes 10 seed packs and a shovel. Rather than just relying on the 3D space to display these offers, we can interact with the farmer and use show offer dialog to bring up a menu with all four offers. If you want something more thematic, you could also make your own custom shop screen from scratch. And if you want more options and ideas, go check out the in-island transaction feature example and our documentation for yourself. We look forward to seeing what you create with the new in-island transaction system.